Dear Henry, you must be such a big girl now, so I know you'd love a pair of big girl pants. I'll bet your pink, I'll bet pink is your favourite colour, love, I look better. Horrid Henry stared in horror, stared in horror at the frilly pink lace knickers, decorated with glittery hearts and bows. This was the worst present he had ever received. Worse than socks, worse than handkerchiefs, even worse than a book. Yuck! Henry took the hideous underpants in the bin where they belonged. Ding dong! Oh no! Rude Ralph was here to play. If he saw those knickers, Henry, Henry would never hear the end of it. His name would be mud forever. Plump, plump, plump. Ralph was stomping up the stairs to his bedroom. Henry snatched the terrible pants from the bin and looked around his room. Wildly for the hiding place. Under the pillow? What if they had a pillow fight? Under the bed? What if they played hide and seek? Quickly, Henry stuffed them in the back of his pants drawer. I'll get rid of them. The moment Ralph leaves, he thought. Mercy, Your Majesty, mercy. King Henry of the Horrible looked down at his snivelling brother. Off with his head, he ordered. Henry, 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 cheered his grateful subjects. Henry! King Henry the Horrible woke up. His medidus mum was looming above him. You've overslept, shrieked mum. School starts in five minutes. Get dressed. Quick, 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 she pulled.